Some things in life are unhealthy. Crack. Bread. Staying up past 10 p.m. But one, you've been misled about, haven't you? Fructose, your new best friend. I get so many comments from people who think fructose is bad just because you've watched a couple lectures on YouTube and you've heard that sugar's bad for you. It was based on studies with corn syrup, mice eating the syrup, I'm bleeding. Oh, why am I bleeding so bad? Oh man, I suck at life. We gotta stop repeating what we hear just so like mindlessly. I got a comment the other day from some guy saying, it's impossible for you to be allergic to dairy. You would never, you know why he said that? Because Audrinus von der Planet said it. I heard him say it in a lecture. That guy's trying to kill me. You can't just repeat it. He was confident. You lacked the confidence. Because you're just repeating what some guy said. You don't know. I know. When I eat dairy, it's not just a, oh, I get a cramp. I bleed for months on end. It's terrible news. I will never try it again. So when it comes to our good old buddy fructose, I've been doing some research. I tell you, so here's the couple myths that surround fructose. One, it turns into fat immediately and causes fatty liver disease. Do you have any idea how long it takes for fruit to be turned into fat? You have to first fill up your entire body of muscle glycogen and liver glycogen before you even consider storing it. Stores it as fat was the end of that sentence. I got distracted. There was a woman in the bush and she disappeared. So she might not even have existed. That's a loud train. So no, fructose does not just go to the liver, turn into fat immediately, cause fatty liver disease. There's no fat fruitarians out there. It's just so hard to convert. Like the body does not want to turn sugar into fat. It even produces body heat before that step. So it takes such a long time and such efforts. You'd have to eat so much fruit. It's almost impossible. So that's another thing. People say fructose makes you fat, but there are none. No fat fruitarians. Like logic and common sense disproves you. It never happens. Where are they then? If it happened, like just because you can make a rat fat with corn syrup and oil, it's the mix, the fat in the mix. Don't mix the carbs and the fats. I've been saying it since day one. I was reading a bunch of scientific studies on fructose, looking for something to dissuade me from fruit. There's nothing, there's nothing. Everything was just beneficial. Like fructose digests so much faster than glucose. It bypasses some pathway that I didn't understand. And it's just like, boom. Not the insulin one, I get what insulin is. It doesn't need insulin, by the way. So it goes to the liver, your body does something with it. The theory is that you convert fructose to glucose to use it. Dr. Morse disagrees. He says, why? Like, why would the body do that? If fructose is a simple sugar already, why would you convert it to another, like, one molecule item? They're the same shit. So the body just uses it as fuel, in my opinion. Doctors, you're debunked. So many people say avoid fructose because you don't want to spike your insulin. You can't spike it with fructose. It doesn't need it. It's like if you want to go low insulin, go high fructose. That Take that to the bank. So honey is back on the menu, isn't it? Fruit? Let me grab some. Let me grab some of this. I'm going to bleed out. So diabetics should be going high fructose, low glucose if possible. If they're afraid, you should be going low fat, really, according to the vegan doctor hippies. But if it's insulin you're afraid of, then you avoid the starch, not the fruit. Fruit is higher in fructose. Boom, instant metabolism. Take it to the bank. Are you seeing this? There's a red carpet down to the creek, leads up to this village. He built a mud wall out of sticks. That took a long time. That is art. It's a cave city. I mean, tent city. I know the difference between tents and caves. Trust me. I wrote a book on it. I've actually been pretty surprised that I've been able to combine the fruit and the meat without getting weird blood sugar issues. I think 
it's because even though I'm causing insulin resistance with the meat, too much fat and protein, I don't need insulin due to the fructose-based nature of my sweet offerings. So even though this blood that's leaking from my finger would look like a vial of duck fat, I seem to be able to metabolize my sugars, no problem. Thanks to the fructose superiority over glucose, and it should be in a menu near you. I'm not afraid of honey, not afraid of fruit, a little bit. I have some fears, only because I still have some acne and some itchiness sometimes. And that used to happen much worse on the fruit diet. So I am blaming fructose for something, but it might not be that, it's just detox. So I wouldn't fear it, I don't, I can't guarantee it, but I just, I don't see the fruitarians complaining about, oh, I got fatty liver again. I got so super fat as well. Like, look to the people doing lots of fructose and see what the problems are. Are they aging faster? Maybe, maybe, but I doubt it. It could be happening to some, I think it's the sun worship. These white people in Costa Rica, that's not your home. I think people just want to latch on to one idea and become famous for it. I found out everybody's sick because of this. They're deficient in vitamin C. It's omega-6. It's the fructose that is causing it. Vitamin A, oh my god. I found it. Just eat simple foods that were created by the Lord up there. Hey buddy. Fruit, vegetable, meat. Boom. Fructose is nature's gift to mankind. Nobody, we have a sweet tooth on our tongue for a reason. Nobody ever tastes sweet fruit and be like, oh, oh God, what was that? Oh. It's sweet. We love it. We love sweet. Can't believe this goes up the hill. That's fantastic. I can't guarantee that fructose isn't harmful, but I'm a health nut looking to avoid any potential possible irritating substance on earth don't run over that squirrel <laughs> is he gonna cross the street i would avoid anything like i avoid everything pretty much fructose is not one of them for now at least I'm just i'm not seeing it if you have a study post it down below i'll look at it i'm open to changing my mind but i haven't seen anything in real life or fake science that teaches us to avoid fruit there was actually one study saying that fructose glycates the body 10 times faster than glucose but that was pretty underwhelming evidence in my opinion so you should still thumb up the video thumbs down if you're making a fructose soup but you're gonna mix it with chicken fat and beef intestines. You're lying if you're doing that. It's one of the least likely, that's a nice flag. So supportive you are, what a good cause. I love our world, love it. How you doing? Thumbing up and subscribing? Good choice, good choice.